Bro's not up for you yet. Recording in progress. Hi, hi. So we left off on page 35 with Haru being like, Oh my god. You guys go home today. And now we have a little time skip where、um, they're out of where they were before, and it seems like they're heading home. And since you're here, why don't you read the first line then? It's like, Kaeri Michi, Yoshida Kun, or, um, What was it? I think it's uh, Damate Watashi o Okute Kureta. And it's in brackets, uh, Oto Ata no Akedo. So it's like, um, on the way home, um, Yoshida said not absolutely nothing, like, while he sent me home, you know? Perfect. Hi. And what does Koto Ata no Dakedo mean? Uh, that's a good question. I think、mm. it's like,、um, yeah, I'm gonna have to consult you on that one. All right. So, first off, let's go look at this no right here. This no right is not normally here, right? You could say, ko,、uh, kedo, right? And that'd be perfectly fine. But we're having、mm. this no here, which you've seen in many different things in Japanese, like with no de, or no da, or no ni, or no o, or no wa, or whatever. Like you said, nihon, sorry, like sudo no wa, something like that. Anything like that. Sometimes this is called、um, like nounification. But what it is,、mm. it's basically it is an undefined item. And you're only referring to one of these items, so it can be a event or a person. It's most commonly used with people, but in this specific context, he's referring to one specific event. So instead,、mm. you could have said, koto wata koto,、mm. uh, dakedo, which would have、um, insinuated that she koto wadud multiple times. But here she says she only koto waduds like once, is basically what she's saying. So she said、um, that she told him、uh, related to this that she kotowadud and she only did this once. She did this right before. This is a single event that we're talking about.、Mm. Um, but kotowadu means to decline.、Oh. What do you think she declined for? <laughs> so it's like,、um, it's like Yoshida offered to take her home and she declined.、Right. Exactly,、yeah. but he took her home anyway. <laughs> That's exactly what it、yeah. is. Hi. Nani mo naku koto nai de sho? Oh. So if you look, it's hard to tell, but Haru is crying his picture.、Uh, and she says, well, well, there's no reason at all for you to be crying, right? So here we're using that koto. It's like the no was over here. But this we're here to sing, there's no reasons, right? Referring to multiple reasons that could possibly exist. So there's no reasons at all. Right? So you could have said、uh, naku no nai, but you probably would do other slurring there because no and nai don't really touch each other normally. But、uh, the right that's there is referring to multiple reasons, basically.、Hmm. So、there's no reason why you should be writing, crying. There's no events that should be causing crying. Right? Yeah.、Um, And the next lines on this page will go to you. Like, chigao, nanka, reshikte,、um, which means like, it's like, no, that's not it. It's like, it's more like, I'm happy. Perfect. Nazi no daro. Why is this? Usagi no mimi ga shinde mo, namida hitotu, de nakata watashi ga. So she says, why do I, the I who did not let out a single tear, Even when the rabbit Mimi died, why is it that I, and then it's kind of just like dropped off for context.、Um, and next part will be for you. She's, yep, she's just kind so, of trailing off here. Yeah, she's continuing on. I kind of recognize that. So it's like, why is it that I, as like Sonotoki, this time,、uh, Kare no Kao, Mite Tara, is like, when I see his face, is like. Perfect. Yeah, you can do the next part too. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> it. Nanda ka,、uh, naki so ni, natte shimata, is like, um, somehow I'm crying a bit. 
Oh, like oh, I'm space. somehow I'm crying too. So soul. Hmm. So this, when you have soul with um, a verb, it means like seems like, right? Like almost you know soul na home is a book that looks, that that looks interesting, right? You're kind of referring to like a physical appearance of something, not something you heard on a rumor. You're making a hypothesis about the future, right? You assume that if someone read the book, it would be good. So soul, a lot of times we'll use, we use with verbs to refer to a hypothetical future that seems probable. So mm. in English, we would actually say this means um, I'm about to cry or I'm going to come to be crying. But she's not saying she is crying, but she feels like she's going to cry type of idea. Just uh. like the book might feel interesting. So it's that same kind of idea, but in English, we'd use different kind of words to do that. Yeah. Um, so overall, it's like, so somehow I feel like crying or it's it's come exactly. to that. I feel like crying. Yeah. Exactly. She says, what a pure tears to have. She says, it's going to be fine, Haru. Um, right now, you're going to have a bunch of people just kind of um, filling up your surroundings. So don't cry, basically. But don't cry is not written there. So the next part of her thoughts we'll go to you, Kiki. Yeah, it's like uh That's a yeah, koto ga arigato ka. No, aru daro. Aru daro ka. Wow. Um so is that koto I just talked about versus no? What does that tell us? Um, more than one thing, or at least one thing. Yeah, we're yeah we're talking about at least one event. Event one plus. So the event of what? Nagashita. Namida o nagasu. Is like um. Uh, are they two different parts like or... not really um no. oh we have a very i mean this the, the weird part here is that we have a relative clause being broken up with a watashiwa but the wa is kind of a signifier that it's not really a part of this as wa is a topic marker and we already have a ga over here marking the actual subject of the sentence of at all so in a way, hmm. you can kind of ignore the watashiwa. So that's just the topic kind of being just stuck in the middle of the sentence randomly. So it's a very yeah. like vocal like thing. So it's just saying uh, nami o nagashita koto ga aru. So I guess we could start with koto ga aru. What does that mean? Uh, like to have something. You can describe it as that, to have something. Uh, most people would describe this as to have this occur to you, that you've had this happen to you at some point, it would be a more accurate way to like normally do this. We're normally, because we got koto here, referring to an event or multiple events, right? So events, not really a thing you can hold. And the word in English, thing can both refer to events and physical items. So it is unclear if you say you have a thing, to whether or not you meaning I have a pen or you saying I have a thing on Saturday. Um, it's a koto like I have a thing on Saturday, right? It's that thing of yeah. the things. Uh, so you're right. It does mean I have a thing, specifically the having an occurrence, uh, an occurrence that exists. So she is talking about herself of having an event to have occurred in her life at some point. This thing that may or may not have occurred is described as nami o nagashita. Do you know what namida means? Um, it's like a tears or something. It is tears, yes. And then we have a O here, letting us know the verb is doing something to it. Do you think the verb of namida is nagasu or aru? Which do you think is the verb that nagasu is actually attached uh, to? That namida, that's what it's attached to? Hi, namida is a noun. What verb is namida 
with the O. Is this O of Namida O? Is this O related to Nagashita? Is it Namida O Nagashita? Or is Namida ga O Aru? Yes, it is Namida O Nagashita. So、yeah. that is our relative clause. It says we have tears, and the tears, it's I do blank two tears, which is、hmm. Nagase. So more commonly, you've probably seen Nagareru. For example,、mm-hmm. kawa ga nagareru.、Mm-hmm. You more commonly will see this as the kawa kanji, but both are kawa. Kawa ga nagareru. Do you have any idea what this might mean? So like a river is flowing. It does mean the river is flowing. You see how this is marked by a ga because the river is doing the action. We have a nice circle verb here. The subject is doing the action of flowing. If you wanted to have a o, right, it would have to become nagasu, right? Like the ma jutsu shi wa kawa o nagasu. The magician makes the river flow, right? Or、yeah. perhaps the farmer makes the magician the river flow using、um, irrigation or something. That's the idea behind that. So here, the thing that's being made to flow are namida. So in other words, this is a really weird way that he's saying that has she ever cried, right? Has she ever、mm. let tears flow? Is what it says. However, we still the relative clause is actually not done yet. Do you know what na tells us?、Um, it's like an adjective. It is. It's a noun adjective. It's a noun that acts as an adjective. So this means this kide is describing namida, and this is complicated. But ni is a adverb marker, which、yep. means it can describe either the adjective or a verb. In this context, I would say it's describing the adjective kide na, because it's probably part of this relative clause. Rather than skipping over kide and describing nagasu, theoretically it could describe any of the verbs here,、um, but it makes more sense to assume it's touching the closest verb to it, or adjective, because adverbs can describe adjectives or verbs. So we're describing namida with this information. What kind of tears is she talking about? It's like, I think she's calling them pretty or something. Or, yeah, pretty.、Um... This pretty tears. So tear、mm. kide is an interesting word in Japanese. You're right that it means pretty. What is another word for kide? Um, it's the literal meaning of it. Pure. Uh, the literal meaning of kide is clean. Yeah. So he's actually referring to like the purity of the tears in this context. I would say rather、yeah. than the actual. Physical, like it's not utsukushi beauty, like the real, real tears. They're pure. They're junsui.、Yeah. So that's why it, it's kind of the, what we know. The reason why we know it's the pure is because the topic of the the page started with what pure tears he has. Have I ever had such clean tears before? But the idea、yeah. is that he's talking about the purity. Yeah.、Uh, so it's now, like, have I ever had、um, such real tears come flow like this? Exactly,、yeah. that's what it says. And then just like I wonder, have I ever? Perfect.、Mm. Uh, now we're doing a flashback.、Uh, just so you know, for this specific book, whenever you see like a black border like that, that's normally a flashback, or the、okay. main character is thinking. It's just an interesting little thing. This book. It happened in Freyren too.、Mm-hmm. They do the black borders. Yeah. It's kind of fun. Different、do. different manga will do different things to signify. I think、uh, Natsume Jinsho does like this kind of design for flashbacks, where it's like a hat, like a very light gray, and kind of fades more.、Mm. Um, okay, so this next panel here will go to you, Tree.、Uh, yep. So、Sorry, we have. Sorry, I'm Tree Cookie. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Nani mite? Ah, nani mite no? It's like a like. Ah、uh, yeah, okamai naku. Um, he's like, what are you looking at? He's like, uh, no. Um, done. It's nothing. Basically means、Something、pay me、like、no mind. Okamai. Yeah. Okamai. It's nothing. So yeah. Nothing. Hey, pay me no mind. Eto, komen ne shite nai hito. Ato de hito yon de agiru kara 
あでもそしたら私がもっけだってバレる So she's thinking, I'm so sorry, human being, I do not know. Later, I will, I'm, or basically right after this, I'm going to go over for you to get somebody. So、uh, don't, don't hold it against me, poor stranger. And then she realized, oh, wait, if I do that, if I go tell somebody about this, then won't they find out I'm a tattler? Oh, no. Because see right、mm -hmm. here in the picture, it's kids being bit up. And then we see Haru. Right here, showing up, and, she's a, and there's ooh, wah, 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 some kind of shocking noises. And Haru is there beating up some kids. So, this is the first day of high school, right?、Wow. Uh, when Haru got expelled.、Um, so, the next two bubbles here will go to you.、Hmm. Uh, so, it's like, what it is, i、like, I, it's like, Yeah, she's a good girl. Um, Iru Nara Gakko Ite Mite Mo. He, um, so Shizuku is her name. Yeah, that's name right. I, I, I recognize that. I'm just trying to think about、um, how to say this properly.、Mm. Um, I think he's trying to say, is like, it, it's like, it doesn't matter if I come to school or not. Good guess. What does Nara mean?、Um, that's an if. It is an if. What kind of if is it? There's like five in Japanese. It's an if slash when statement because that's the same idea in Japanese. Which,、uh, what makes Nada special versus Tada that we saw earlier today, or To, or Areba? What, what makes Nada special?、Um, it's more like an if it's true that, yeah? yeah? In some way, it's person specific. Person specific? Tada is、mm. event specific. To is 100% certainty, and Aredu、mm. is just generic. Yeah. So if you're using nada, you're referring to a very specific human or very specific location, can also happen. But a lot of times it's like an insinuated, like for us at that location, rather than like that location in general. It's just you're narrowing down who we're talking about. So here, even though we're talking about Suzuku, the nada is more about him, I would say, than anything else. So literally, this is if Suzuku was here, right? If Suzuku exists. That's what it says. But、mm. contextually, he's talking about himself. For me, if Izuku is existing contextually at a certain location, then I can do the next thing, basically、right. saying. So if this happens, the next thing can happen, which is true with、yeah. all win statements. That, that's, so, <laughs> that's just、I'm、what it means to... to have an if win statement is if this is true, the next one. But it's just saying, if this is true, then I can do the next thing,、yeah. not somebody else. So what I can、yeah. do is. Go Gakuni, try and go to school. Yes. You did perfect with the try. It says the try right there. I will try to go to school. So you write the E means it would be okay, right? It'd be okay、mm. if I tried to go to school if Shizuku was there. So the most important、yeah. part was the if Shizuku is there part.、Um, and then she laughs. Ha ha ha. Sorry, I'm so good. Nanka, doki doki suru. So she laughs and says, ha ha ha. In that case, that's good. And then Haru says, hmm, something about this is making my heart thump. And Shizuku says, ha?、Huh? What?、Um, Ore, Shizuku ga suki kamo, which is, I might like Shizuku. And the next bubble here will go to you, Cookie. Eh, so, so, it was, tomodachi teki na imi de, is like, So, does that mean,、um, well, well, like friends? Yeah, like, you mean like in a、yeah. friend like way? That's why、yeah. you like me? Yeah, say teki na imi de. No, in a、um, opposite sex kind of way.、Um, and the next part right here will go to you. Yep.、Um, and it's like, urara kana. 
how do you know he so i'll just read this part first um it's a bright um spring yep it's a bright it's a bright spring day and it's like it's like for the first time in Hi. yeah so for the first time in my life um i did a confession close right. suru means to do so kokohaku suru means to do a convection do you know what a de ru what that tells us when suru became saseru is to get someone else to do it yeah that's causative form but um, this is a passive form. So it means I was confessed to. Oh, okay, fair enough. To make someone do it would be saseru. So we have to have the set in the middle for um, or making someone else do something. Mm. Boop, boop, boop. Tsugi no hi. This is like the clip I shared with. Next day, Haru-kun wa honto ni gakko ni kimashita. The next day, Haru actually went to school. And um, down here, we'll go to you, Cookie. Yep. So, yeah, um, so it's like, she, Shizuku is like calling out for a, like, uh, Ashina, um, so, so, kun de, um, so it's like, so like, Shizuku, uh, my feet are frozen, I can't move. It's like, nande kon na koto, um, kon na koto iru no yo. It's like, why are you here? Perfect. Yeah. That's it. But it's done in a very like annoyed way. And then yeah, we have yeah. some people talking about them saying, tsutete kure, which is like, oh, he's um bringing him with her, basically. So tsurete is like, come with, and then kure is like the do for somebody. Ooh. Hmm. I don't know, it's kind of weird. That's a tweeteku we just saw. Um, so, Haru, right? He is coming with me, um, but he's right behind me when he's doing it. And it's almost like he's a baby duck, like he's a little duckling behind me because he is so afraid of the, the school. It seems that the school is so afraid. So somehow, so altogether, so somehow or the other, because he seems like he's so truly afraid of school, it's come to be that Haru is following after me like a duckling. Yeah. Um, um, oops, what did I click? Um, so these people here laugh. <laughs> what even is that? And then Haru gets a mad about that. And she's like, um, Puri. Oh, sorry, not Suri, Puri. She says, I'm going to pretend that I'm not involved in this at all. And then she runs away. She nigerus. And the next uh, two bubbles here will go to you. Like in class, they're like, um, Nani wa, Nani wa dore are? Is like a, and in any case, or at right. at any rate, is like yoyaku tonari no um seki ga umatta wa kede um finally at last um in the adjacent seat um. I don't think buried is the right thing uh, to say here. It's the opposite. Here. It's uh, to be filled. Yeah, to be filled. It's the same kanji for to be buried. I don't. It's it's it's, it's always like confusing. I agree to be like, is this buried? Is this is it the opposite? So yeah, um, I think we have to keep reading. Medu is to bury, and umaru is to be buried. So because of that, <laughs> it's like the opposite. Hmm. So finally, in the adjacent seat, um, 
Oh, oh, this the uh, adjacent seat was filled with um, you know, that guy, Yoshida. Basically, Now the I get walk it. is saying that's how I would say. Yeah. So this is you say that's how the seat next to me got filled. I finally got filled. Yeah. What a lucky guy. What a lucky guy. <laughs> Sitting right next to his favorite person in the whole wide world. <laughs> でも驚いた本当に来たんだ。And he says, "Well, I was surprised you actually came." And he says, "くるよ." He says, "Um, I'm I'm gonna be coming like often." And the next bubble here will go to you, Cookie. was like, "Oh, she was uh sanko sho um Oh, uh, so it's something to do with the reference book. Um, You're right. Mekuru means to flip pages. Do you know what the tutu is telling us? while, so while I was flipping through the reference book. Kind of, yeah. Uh, so what would you think of it more like? I don't know. I feel like tutu, I guess it is wild. I just think about it more as like continuum. <laughs> just Okay, like it's not sure. Nagara. I don't know. But yeah, it's Kind wild. of the same thing. If you Kind ask of, me, yeah. yeah. So like, kino no are no kotoba omoi dasu no da no da. Um, I recalled the words he said from yesterday. Hi. So it's like, ch, chotto matte is like, wait a moment. There's Oh, you're a right. flashback. It's a flashback. So, 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 uh, oh, that's probably just you imprinting on me, or is that what it, what it's called, or something like that? And the next part right here, is your cookie? Uh, yep, so it's like, Hoka ni tomodachi inai kara, uh, kanchi ga, kanchi, kanchi ga ishiteru da to mo. Um, I think it's like, I'm going to guess other friends, or is it besides, um, yeah. Other friends, um, Inai. yeah, not being present. So because Yeah. no one else is present, um, it's like Something there's been Shizuku a mis- is saying. Yeah, Hi. so it's like there's been a misunderstanding because no one else is present. Yes. She says, Yeah. I think this is something you'd call imprinting on someone, right? Oh, that you're just being, you're just mistaken. You don't actually Yeah. like me as an opposite sex. It's, you just don't have any friends. And Wow. he's like, So he says, well, then would it be fine like for me to like you or for us to date idea if I made some friends? And what does Suzuku think after that? Um, he's like, ah, even the more so more than the um, uh, I thought that myself. Yeah. Or it could have been he I thought think. that as self. Either or both. So it's like, wow, he even thought that himself. Both I'm sorry, are that's fully not po both are a hundred yeah, percent possible. I think yeah. the I, I don't know. It's like who who it could be either. Uh,わかった。わかったよ。I got it。でも多分、怖、怖、怖、怖ね。But, you know, probably it won't change。私はきっとお前のこと好きだよ。I will definitely like you。Boop. And now we have little mini comics, which is Zen... Zen... It's a fast. Zen soku... So even though she ran at full feed, at, at full speed, and then the line underneath will go to you, Cookie. Yeah, so like, uh, it's like, uh, shake, what? Shake, um, but to get the, um, the, the shoes, the, 
Oh, it's a dash, so shake, dash you. Yes. And yeah, shaker dash, is a um, milkshake. Like the shake. They're talking about the time when they threw the shakes Hi. at each other. Yes. Yeah. Um, Shizuku. So it's like, um, Shizuku is like really trying to run as hard as he can after, you know, getting hit by the shake or, you know. It's the opposite. After she threw the shake at Haru. Yes, yes, I, Yeah, that's um, the point. Um, <gasps> Wait! Wait, where did you disappear off to? Kso! Yes! Haya something. Haya sugida? I don't know what that's saying. But he says, oh, she, her legs were so fast. My goodness, she just disappeared. So that's Hayai and Onna. Oh, Hayai Onna. Da. Wow, she is a lady with crazy fast legs. And next line here, we'll go to mm. you. So it's like a Amari ni ashi ga oso sugi tatame ki kizu kare na katta yo desu. Um, Do you, so do you know what yo means? It's very similar to so that we just saw like a moshiro so. It's like a like. It is a like, exactly. The difference between using so here is that so is like a hypothetical. Yo is like, it seems like this is what had happened. It's yeah, not really so, future. So it's like she realized. Um, in this case, I would say he's talking about Haru in this context that Haru did not realize, right? past tense negative yeah. realizing so it's like she did not realize that um, he did not yes yeah um so this i is don't know hard. what this tame is doing here what does tame normally mean do you know uh like a purpose or a means yeah. to purpose mm. it can also mean because uh, depending on how you want to translate it. It's the same idea behind it, so it's not like a different grammar point. It's just like the same how if and when are the same word in Japanese. It's the same kind of idea as that. So the tame here is basically, you could say because of this, the next thing happened. It's just it's not a cause and effect relationship. It's, it's just like an explanation for why the next thing happened. Yeah, Which, so I'm saying that um, she... It is like she didn't realize quite mm. that. No, he, legs... he didn't realize. Oh, he didn't realize that um, his legs were like. Good guess. Too it's her slow. legs. Right. <sighs> so, because her legs were too slow, it seems like he didn't realize it. <laughs> so, thamet means because. So, because the yep. legs were way too slow, the realization did not seem to happen. So that's how you could yeah. translate this if you didn't know what it meant. And then you kind of just have to fill in with the context of who is yeah, legs, who realized. Uh, mm. So it's not stated in there, but picture wise, we just saw Shizuku running and she's right here and he went, Pah! where are you going? So mm. that's just an explanation of what happened. Um, uh, Kaoru ga mo duckling. Um, so why don't you read the first panel? The first panel is like, uh, toko, um, toko, shonichi. So it's like um, the first day of attending school. Well, for um, Yoshida anyway. It's like um, karuga, karuga mo na haru. It's like Haru is being a spoiled duck on his first yeah. day back at school. <laughs> and then it's like, um, I don't know what that bit at the top says, but it it's says like... It says like, Sentaku for some reason? Sentaku Jugyo, I believe. Which so what like kind of class is it? choosing your class? Yeah, I guess. It's like choosing classes. It's like, Uzai. It's like, um... Oh, oh elective class. That's like, what it means. Enough. <laughs> so, Zai is like, um, this is like, uh, this is like annoying, this right? Mm -hmm. Annoying. And then, uh... um, 
もう諦めた。あ、あ、どうもう諦めた。Oh, he's already like done with it. Not even thinking it's annoying anymore. And、mm. it looks like, I believe the top country is like he's buying lunch or something like that, like at the shop area buying. But I actually don't know how to read that. Purchasing is the first country. Coal buy. So it just means buying something, which is contextually food. And then, how do you start to follow her into the girl's bathroom? And what does she say, <laughs> Cookie? Oh, yeah, so cool. I eat kind of, um, which, uh, don't worry about our promise or whatever. Perfect. That's exactly what she's saying. And we'll stop here since that's the end of chapter one.、So、wow, we did it. Stop recording. Do, 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 do.